Hello, and thank you for watching. My name is Rachel Barnett with Gentle Frog. I'm here to create videos for you to help you understand QuickBooks slightly better than you currently do. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please put them in the chat box. Thank you. In this video, I'm going to show you how to record a loan where you lend somebody else money. To record the loan, I'm going to start in my chart of accounts. To get to my chart of accounts, I'm going to go to the gray bar on the left hand side of my screen, go to accounting, and then chart of accounts. If you'd prefer an alternative method, you can go to the gear in the upper right hand corner of your screen, go to the left hand side, and then go down to chart of accounts. Next, what you want to do is click on plus new in the upper right hand corner. You'll select asset. When it says save account under, it's just asking you where to put it on the chart of accounts. If that doesn't make sense, then I want you to think about where do I want it to see it on my balance sheet. It's going to be an other current asset if you expect to get the money repaid within 12 months. If the loan is going to be repaid in longer than 12 months, it's going to be a long term asset. Let's just make believe this will be repaid in longer than 12 months. I'm going to scroll down to other asset. It's kind of funny. It's hidden back here. Tax form selection, it doesn't matter, but for the purpose of this video, I'm going to select other long-term asset. Account name, this is what I'm going to call it. So I'm going to say um, loan to XYZ company. So loan to XYZ company, I'm not going to add a description. I'm definitely not going to add a starting date or an opening balance. And now I'm going to click save. I could have shortcut this by creating the account when I entered the check, but I like to do things one step at a time. So that way, if something happens, if I get interrupted, I at least know that I'm part way there. The next thing you'll want to do if this has not already come through your bank feeds is to click on plus new in the upper left hand corner to go to vendors, to go to check, assuming you wrote a check, and then you'll just indicate who gets the check. So I'm going to say XYZ company earlier, we made an account that said loan to XYZ company. N now this is me adding XYZ company as a vendor in my QuickBooks. I'm going to select save in the lower right hand corner. Um, I'll give it check number 314 is just fine. And then down here for category, I'm going to say that it is my loan. So my loan to XYZ company, I'm going to loan them $15,000. I'm going to save and close. Let me just show you how this shows up on the balance sheet so you can see it. So when I go to the balance sheet and I come down here to my assets, I can see that it's right here. This is money that I'm expecting to receive back and I'll just keep track of the payments as they come in. I hope this video has been helpful. If there's anything that my team or I can do for you, please reach out. If you'd like to see other videos or if you have any questions, please leave them down below in the comments. Thank you so much.